Hey and welcome back to 16 years now Kim Free. The plan was to stay on the English-Scottish border, but for a number of reasons I couldn't. Uh, number one, there was no internet. Well, that doesn't stop me staying there. I just couldn't be buying and getting that board. Number two, it's a bit iffy because I was talking to the bagpipe player and they said, well, sometimes they're okay with it, sometimes they're not. And he said, but there has been a spate of people, well, bad things happening to them. Uh, so I came uh, I, back into England and I kept going and 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 going until I finally got some internet at a little place called Osserburn. And it was brilliant because, uh, you know, I parked up thinking, right, I've got to check on the map where I am, um, you know, in relation to everything. Because it was saying Newcastle, like 32 miles. I was like, well, I've been through there. I don't want to go back that way. So I pulled up and then the internet came back up, which is a brilliant thing. Uh, then I went on part four night and literally from where I was parked is, well, that house over there <laughs> was where I was parked up and this is uh, one of the places. Uh, I went into the little cafe, asked them if it's okay to park here and they were like, yeah, well, other people do, so I can't see why not, but I always ask, but, you know, at this, not a bad place for a park up, is it? Not a, bla a bad place at all. Oh, but yeah, some of the driving today, it's been awesome. Brilliant roads, brilliant scenery, I wish I took um, more photos of it. Uh, you know, oh, two seconds guys, hey, there we go, yeah, I wish I took more um, photos and more video, but I'll be going back up past that way anyway, because I want to go and see um, the house of um, Mary, Queen of Scots, let's remember that, because uh, that did look absolutely fantastic, but yeah, even with um, the people uh, up at the border, I was chatting to a couple of people on motorbikes, and one of, it was a couple on the same motorbike, they were going out for a day ride, and I was explaining what I was doing, but yeah, all the way along these um, roads and whatnot, some of the things I see, you know, with like, you know, people giving it the thumbs up as they're going past, you know, kids are looking out the window. Um, you guys on motorbikes, I love you. you. You guys are the best at times. You know, when they come up beside me and literally then pull over, slow right down, slow right down when we're on a dual carriageway, slow down, give it a nod and then like, Bleh! You know, uh, yeah, I have, uh, at one point I had him, uh, you know, coming in front of me, coming behind me, giving me all the thumbs up. You can see him from the eyes, like, eee, that's really cool. You know, um, people in camper, camper vans, uh, other people in cars, custom cars and things like that. Just, you know, absolutely loving William, you know, loving what I'm doing on this trip. Um, yeah, was a, 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 bit, a bit wary today. It's uh, been a lot of driving, a lot, a lot of driving. Um, shame I couldn't go to the observatory. Um, I might try that at uh, a different point. Um, shame about not being able to camp in uh, Kilda Forest. Uh, that is a big, big shame, actually, because I wasn't. That was one of the ones I was looking forward to. I was really looking forward to that. But it is what it is. Um, I might try and do a little bit more research and find out if there is somewhere or a cheap campsite. I think I saw a hostel there, but I'm not too sure on the prices of it. So I'll have to do that some research. But yeah, I've come back down. I'm more on the east side of the country than the west so i think it'd be a case of wiggling my way back west after the after here i might spend a couple of days here because it's nice there's a shop up there um i'm not i did say i was gonna go for a breakfast but for 10.95 for a breakfast no no not when i've been getting them for like three pound fifty and three quid <laughs> you know yeah, i'm not gonna do that but yeah here i am in the what's it going? Uh, lovely little bridge over there. Looks like some decent walks and some picnic tables. Lovely little village to have a wander around. I'm not doing that today. Um, I must admit, I'm knackered. I've been on the road since, what, about 8 o'clock this morning. Um, I should have stayed where I was. I know I should have, but, you know, you know, I just wanted to move on. It's what I do. But, yeah, um, it was lovely to be in Scotland. Uh, I can't wait to go back. But, yeah, now it's uh, heading west. Uh, across that way and I might come down the uh, west coast like I did going up the um, east coast uh, past Robin Hood Bay and everything like that I might come down past uh, Morecambe um, I've never been to Blackpool so I might go into Blackpool I'm not too sure I was thinking of going to Lockerbie today but there wasn't many places to park over there which is quite strange um, plus you know I, I want to save Scotland for when I go back up in the September um, yeah that's what I want to do, I want to save it for when I go back up in the September. Otherwise, I want to just like you know, inch north, inch north, and I want to be in there anyway. 
and then I went back to come all the way back down, so I wasn't going to do that. But yeah, here we are. It's been a long day. I'm quite tired, <laughs> but it's been an amazing drive. I've seen some amazing people. It's just been amazing, really. But on that note, take it easy, keep adventuring, and love you, bye.